The e-commerce industry in Indonesia has been growing at a massive rate over the last five years. With e-commerce accounting for 8% of total retail sales in 2018 and estimated to reach a share of 18% by 2023. In this episode, we'll take a look at Tokopedia and their innovation strategies to stay ahead in the market in future Indonesia. Founded in 2009, Tokopedia has grown from an online marketplace to a massive tech unicorn that offers a myriad of digital services. In the market like us, we need to basically do a lot of learnings in order for us to make it happen, make it better, right? focus on consumer. We continue asking ourselves what we can actually do for our consumer. But like every growing company, challenges abound when it comes to digital innovations. Let's rewind a year back. At that time, Tokopedia was about to celebrate the nine-year anniversary. We introduced into the market of bringing television and combining it into the digital landscape during the largest festival in Indonesia called Ramadan Extra. No technology company has ever done the scale of what we've done before. We actually prepared a lot for that. However, the traffic that actually comes in during that event turned out to be way above our expectation. You know, imagine you organize a party for like 100 people and then you have like 200, 300 people show up. Even if they have a, a good time, you you know that you, you would have done better. After that, the whole technology team basically held it back together and asked ourselves how we can actually do this again in the next year of Ramadan Extra, which also happened closer to our 10-year anniversary a decade. We worked very closely with Alibaba Cloud to ensure that we had like very rapid response times to any infrastructure capacity-related issues that we had. Thankfully, in the last one year, together with Tahir, we are able to crack the architecture, making it better, fine-tuning it, try to see what we can actually do together with Alibaba. And a year later, not only we are able to survive the Ramadan Extra Special, we actually reach new heights and new breaking records in almost every single metrics that we have. Everything that we do is basically to enable our customer to be better, to be able to do anything, to be able to find anything at Tokopedia. That was at that time we realized that definitely there are cases where our customer cannot search using a standard keyword or standard uh, voice. Let's say I see you somewhere on the street and I like your t-shirt and I was like, okay, I want one like that, right? And how do I search for that? So for those kind of use cases, having image recognition and image-based search and those kind of capabilities are really, really helpful in driving new sort of behaviors and consumption patterns for our customers. So that was an innovation that we did with Alibaba Cloud and it was, it was really helpful. A lot of the challenges that I mentioned before, logistic challenges, financial services challenges, how do we enable our merchant so that they are able to basically sell more at Tokopedia, how we basically enable our merchant with the best advertisement technology in such a way when they actually spend money on the advertisement, the return is going to be high. There are a lot of opportunities that we can do and I feel that the primary strength is not the what, but I think the how. I think to me, because of that partnership that allows us to do above and beyond together with Alibaba Club. By leveraging Alibaba Cloud's innovative solutions, Tokopedia continues to stay on top of its competition in an ever-changing market.